What's good, guys? If you want cheap, fast, and reliable NBA 2K20 My Team coins, head on over to NBAsafe.com and use code BUGS for 5% off at checkout. What's good, YouTube? It's your boy Bugs back on another NBA 2K20 My Team video. And guys, today have some market talk, have some market tips for you guys. Market is pretty crashed, so we're gonna go over a ton of things, a ton of cards. And guys, as per usual, there are 20,000 MT in the comments. Like the video if you're new. If we get 60 likes in this video, um, first of all, we're gonna drop a second video after this. I'm thinking about starting a mark a talk, like literally just a series of me talking about what I'm doing in 2K, what I'm doing with my tokens, what I'm doing with market. So make sure to drop a like for the new series. It's gonna be a pretty interesting series. We're just gonna pretty much go over everything on the market, pretty much a bunch of different things all in one video. That because I just love talking about 2K. So make sure to drop that like for that as well. And as for usual. Um, like I said, 20k in MT in the comments, and also follow my Twitter down below. Um, so we're gonna go over a ton of things, a ton of like uh, the pack odds, pretty much everything in this video. Uh, also, the market. I forgot to say one thing and I can't remember it, so hopefully it comes back to me. But yeah, right now I'm on the last Rick Barry challenge. I'm trying to get all these done, but yes, I do have work the next couple days, so it looks like I will have to be. Um, What's it called? Pre-recording some videos. I'm probably gonna do one video around 12 pre-recorded and then come home from work and do another video around 5, 6. If that's cool with you guys, let me know in the comments. If you wanna see some certain episodes, also let me know in the comments. So, with that being said, um, I honestly feel like we're gonna have Spotlight Series pack opening, uh, a Spotlight Super Packs Friday. I don't know if they're gonna drop the last Spotlight. I have a feeling they're not. I feel like they're gonna drop Super Packs instead. But yeah, I really do think some fire content is gonna drop Friday. But with that being said, right now, um, market's actually very crashed, and I'm gonna show you why. Um, the diamond filter has been ruined, unfortunately. It's almost destroyed. So I bought Austin Carr, Tony Allen to enable the filter even more. But since they do have those token packs in, in um, since they do have those token legacy series packs, the market kind of got destroyed from it. So right now, diamond filter is a little destroyed. You're gonna have to buy some players to enable it. Um, I bought Austin Carr. I bought Tony Allen. I bought Jojo White because they all destroy the filter. So now by impressing able, they are gone. So the filter is somewhat usable by position. That's the problem. It's kind of destroyed. Um, but I did get a ton of snipes off this. I also spent about 150k in MT on packs. Got nothing. So uh, yeah, we gotta work our MT. Keep grinding. Keep grinding. Keep grinding. I also just threw up my Hakeem. I have a bad fear that they're gonna drop spotlight super packs, so I decided to throw him up. Hopefully, I could get at least 220k out of him. Um, I have the whole entire Allen Iverson spotlight challenge ready to roll, and uh, yeah, right now uh, I'm gonna go over some players. As you can see, bro, the market actually crashed a lot. Kristaps dropped a ton. What's his name? Um, who's a new player I dropped? Brandon Ingram also dropped a ton. Also, for all you people that do have your spotlight cards. Like I know a lot of people are working on the spotlights right now. It's actually not a bad time to sell, I'm not gonna lie. Pretty good day to sell cards. Market's actually kinda crashed. Friday, I'm, I'm expecting something really big Friday, like really big. It could be a Chinese New Year promo, it could be spotlight super packs, it could be the new spotlight. But honestly, with all this hype with the Chinese New Year, I honestly do not see them dropping, like they gotta do something for the Chinese New Year, they do it every year. So honestly, I don't think we are going to see like spotlight series this week. I don't know. You guys could quote me on it. I don't know. I honestly feel like they are going to drop a spotlight. I mean, I really feel like I think they dropped super packs before. So that's the way that's the reason why I'm saying that. But uh, yeah, Austin Carr is 6K. If you guys want to pick some up, it's honestly not a terrible idea. I feel like he might go up in value. Um, But let me think. So right now I'm going to go over some cards. Tell you guys what to do, what to sell, and also some snipe filters in this video. So right now we got, um, what's it called? We got the power forwards going up a lot. Some of the pink diamonds are expensive. Honestly, today's a really good day to sell, not gonna lie. Brandon Ingram dropped a ton. Very, very, very good day to sell. I like, I feel like a lot of bad things are gonna happen. A lot of like market crash is gonna come. 110% of market crash is gonna come, even though the market is crashed already. So what you should do, honestly, sell everything you got, either today or tomorrow, because Friday they have to drop something fire. They're guaranteed to drop fire. They're guaranteed to destroy our day. 
and with my i'm pretty much after this buy series gonna sell everything in my collection because that's what i have i have way over a million mt i'm probably gonna try to get up to at least 500k mt try to snipe get ready for friday but then again pre-recorded videos are going going to be down going down tomorrow the next day the next day so pre-recorded videos for thursday friday saturday um hopefully we get a new content video friday not totally sure okay so right now what i would be doing a lot of people are trying to stack up their collections so if you want i would try the silver filter it's pretty money i myself am trying to stack up my collections so look for a wizard that ish smith's actually a really good really good price i actually might pick that up um there's a lot of cards that you should be looking for a ton of cards look for kings players look for stuff like that that's gonna be the number one um pretty much teams with no amethyst as their main player is gonna be the bread and butter of this filter heat check filters also money i'm trying to fill up my heat check so i would try to do that as well heat check filters simply the same thing pretty much just a little more expensive like 1650 for wesley i will gladly add him to my collection we got 1700 there's a lot of cards that you could uh buy and possibly sell later also whoa what just happened Definitely do not want to do that. I do not want to do that. Never lock in any of these spotlight challenges. Like, I promise you. I'm actually so scared right now. Okay. So, with that being said, right now, what I want to do, what I would think you should do. So, now, spotlight series, super pack are possibly dropping. I would recommend selling every single spotlight card you have. No matter what, I honestly do not believe in keeping any of these cards. Do not lock in the set. To make MT right now, you're going to have to sell all your cards, get ready for either even tomorrow, Thursday or Friday. The market is crashed. Diamond filter is working. Um, Amethyst filter is also working. All those people that stacked up on Trish and Thompson's, let me know how it went. I actually made a ton of MT off Trish and Thompson's. I literally got like 20 of them for like 1500 and sold them all for 3,500 3, plus, made about 1,500 MT off each of them. So that's pretty solid. That's like 40K about, 30K made off them. We got more, um, a lot of people, a lot of people are dropping in price. So make sure to stay tuned for my videos. I'm trying to think, Amethyst 20s. If you guys do have Amethyst 20s, honestly, today might be your last day to sell. Something crazy is dropping. They're so cheap right now. Honestly, if you see the Anthus 20s this cheap, it means the market is simply crashed. Like 5900 for an Anthony Davis is outrageous. He's been 10k the whole entire like last 2 months. But yeah, like I said, Diamond Filter, what do I have? I've have Austin Carr, Tony Allen, um you have to add Jamal Wilkes, Jerry West and Earl Monroe for this filter to actually work because if you don't and Jojo White, you kind of need 100k for this filter to work, which is a little annoying. But it's definitely worth it because you get one snipe, you make a minimum of like 10k. What you want to look for is moments and stuff like that. But honestly, anything you buy, I would recommend if you buy anything, try wait till tomorrow to sell because the auction probably go up a little bit more tomorrow. Today is a decent day to sell. Not the best day though because the market is kind of crashed. But then again, it's going to crash again Friday. So if you do buy some pink diamonds... And Friday they drop super packs and you have Hakeem, you're going to take a fat L. He's going to go down to 140. So he is one of the best centers in the games, but he has a lot of value. Also, I'm trying to get Kristaps Porzingis. If you guys do have him, he's going to go up in value a ton. I would recommend trying to get him. He is in the Prime Series for the 200 tokens or whatever, the Galaxy Oval player. So if you do want to get Kristaps, today's probably your like last day. Or maybe Friday might be the best day to get Kristaps. He's going to be really cheap. Also, if you do want Bird, uh, Larry Bird is actually really expensive. So his price will probably keep rising. He is rare as hell. There's literally none on the auction. Everybody has him. And also, one other tip. If you guys know a tournament's coming up and you want to make MT, try to sell your whole entire team an hour or two before the tournament. So if you have Hakeem, try to get on like four hours before the tournament starts. Sell your team. That's another really good tip of selling MT because everyone bought or buying MT. I mean trying to make empty because everybody tries buying their team right before the tournament and i saw um chris stops price was at like 280 hakeem's price was at 260 larry bird's price was at 240 so just letting you know another tip for you guys right now 
All I'm really gonna say, like I said in this video, sell your team. Let me know how it goes. Uh, ask me some questions in the comments. I'll answer all of them. And honestly, that's all I got. Hope you guys enjoyed. Stay tuned for the next video later. And uh, yeah, that's pretty much it, guys. Hope you enjoyed. Peace.